on TV, and and it co co if it coincides with the other TV show, the sports will always be over it. The sports will always go over the TV show. Uh, because it's that important. Uh, <laughs> Um, and that is our today's topic is about slow TV. <laughs> I included a link to this article. <laughs> I included a link to this article. Uh, and let me uh, make sure that I've got all the right things turned off. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. Uh, but I will give you just the general idea, which is uh, every... Every culture has their own very unique uh, aspect of television. Television trope. Television gimmick or thing that makes that is very unique to every major culture. Uh, in America, it's the, um, the fact that uh, professional sports will always go be over any other t sort of TV. Any TV that you are watching, if there is if there is a sports event on TV and and it co co if it coincides with the other TV show, the sports will always be over it. The sports will always go over the TV show. Uh because it's that important. Uh <laughs> In, uh, in the UK, it's Christmas specials. Every show, every series has a Christmas, either a special, a special episode about Christmas for that TV show, or a Christmas theme within the show. Uh, so that's, that's another example. In Norway, uh, about a decade ago, they, they tried something. They put a camera inside the conductor's uh, area of, of a train, and they just did a live broadcast of a train ride. No music, no story, no action, no dr drama, just the sound of the train wheels and the tracks in the wind outside. And it was just this uh, a video, just TV, of a train, a normal, ordinary train ride from one city to the next, and it took like four hours, and millions of people watched it. So now, slow TV is a is a an established TV show, uh, a Norwegian TV, and it's not just there. They're, they're doing it in Japan, too. And there are tons and tons of music videos. Not music videos. Why did I say music videos? A TV, YouTube videos. A YouTube videos. Um, that, are, that are just train or car rides or um, bus rides from one place to another faraway place. Sometimes they have music um, I will sometimes uh, put on a, a highway driving video with a lo-fi music or ambient music or electro electronic music in the background, and, and I'll sleep to that. But uh, what I wanted to share with you really is um, what I fall asleep to, which is on in the background but what i want to share with you is uh the japanese train videos i i made a youtube playlist that goes on it did i get that yeah i'm, pl I'm playing just a little bit of it but it's not doing it what's going on what's going on oh it's just taking a while for the guy for the guy to go so as you can see it's an hour and a half video it's an hour and a half video of 
just uh, a train, Japanese train, and it's just gonna go, and then this is getting boring, so I'm gonna get my letter to skip ahead a little bit. Huh. Yeah, it's just train videos. Um, and it's not doing anything special. It's there's no music. It's just you know the sound of a train. Sometimes the conductor making announcements and whatnot. I'm not gonna do the the video. I'm not gonna do the audio. Um, lots of translations here to go. How about this one? No. There you go. So what are there are a lot of translations. What I like about this video is is I used to live in Osaka. This is Osaka and Wakayama. I used to work in Wakayama. I took this train. I took this train a lot. And so playing this this video kind of brings me back to that time in my life. Um, it's sort of funny. Like I said, very calm and very relaxing. Um Wakayama is like really in the suburbs. It's very rural, uh, but yet we're seeing all these train stations. That's so funny. Um, and then there's Osaka. Let's see if I can't go back to this. There you go. That's a better view. That's Wakayama. There you go, Wakayama. Very rural countryside driving. But again, very calming, very relaxing. But if you're more of a city type, um, there you go. I don't know why it stopped. Why did it stop? It stopped right what happened to it but i can see the video going like the video is still going but the train has stopped why oh it's going now uh yeah this is this is in uh osaka south osaka i would say senkai i think this is probably senkai which is another city which is just to the south just just under o osaka and again it's just um you know just video yeah so i think that's it i just wanted to share Yeah. Um, yeah, the point, the whole point of this is to uh, talk about, hey, wh what are what are some cool things to do that you can do to relax, unwind, not have to think about anything? Because sometimes you just want to turn turn the lo the logic and the thinking and the imagination, the dreaming stuff off. You just want to have something to look at that's that's very calming very relaxing uh and for me it's trains <laughs> so there you go i hope this helps you uh because it definitely has helped me i've i have fallen asleep many times watching uh train videos and i will sometimes do a lot of my editing work with a train video on and on a screen because because it helps focus me and it keeps me calm so there you go